Since 1999, the Uganda Bureau of Statistics has been carrying out periodic household surveys to inform policymakers in decision making and planning for the country. Today, the statistics body released its seventh survey report with the findings revealing that the poverty levels among Ugandans has risen in spite of the numerous efforts by government to reduce it. Although the poverty levels have not changed much, but the proportion of people who are poor between these two surveys increased from 8 million to 8.3 million people. People working from mouth to hand to mouth increased from 3.3 million to 3.5 million. Actually, Bukeda and Karamoja sub-regions registered an increase in the number of poor people, but Busoga still has the highest number of poor people in Uganda. Policy analysts have blamed the persistent poverty in Busoga on their leaders who they say are not doing enough to resolve the problem. You say that leadership matters. Hmm? So I think it has to start with the leaders uh, coming from Busoga to sit back and think through how best can we help our people and how best can we change their mindsets. We should start from there. Affirmative programs, probably Kate Busoga should benefit from such affirmative programs. The report shows that 14.5% of the people in Busoga are poor, followed by Bukedi with 10.4%, and actually, is closed by 10.3%. According to the experts, the rise in the levels of poverty, especially in rural areas, is due to the effects of COVID-19 pandemic. Poverty has remained the same. However, the COVID incidence increased the poverty from 19% to 22%. A number of poverty alleviation programs we are initiated by government, but policy analysts say poverty programs and interventions have not had any dent on reducing poverty. All our interventions between the three years have not really had an impact on people's living standards. Majority of the population in Kalamonja and the Bukhead cannot afford a pair of shoes. Jingo Francis, NTV.